Got another question on the enthalpy and entropy topic. So this one focuses on enthalpy. As always, the link to the questions in the description of the video if you want to try it first. So part A, definition of the term lattice enthalpy is the enthalpy change when one mole of an ionic lattice is formed from its gaseous ions. So the species in this box here, well, what's the process taking place for step E? It's going to be the second ionisation energy of calcium. So effectively, we're going to turn this Ca1 plus gaseous ion into Ca2 plus gaseous. So species present would be those there. So moving on to step G, so what's happening here? Well, we're going to put that electron onto that O minus gas and turn that into O2 minus gas. Moving on to part two, I'll keep the cycle on the screen so I think it'll be easier for me to explain if I can refer to the cycle. So we have to name step A. So what, what's going on in step A? We're going from the elements to the compound calcium oxide. So that is the enthalpy of formation of calcium oxide. Moving on to step C, so this one here. So what's changing? We're going from a half a mole of O2 gas to one mole of O gas. So you're going from the element to one mole of gaseous atoms. That's the atomization of oxygen. And step G, which we've already talked about, what's happening here? Well, we're going from O minus gas to O2 minus gas, that electron's going on. So this is the second electron affinity of oxygen. Back to the cycle for the calculation, just to explain how you do it, and then I'll do the number crunching on the actual question. So you can see I've colour coded the um, two routes. So starting from elements, you can go to the compound via step A alone. So that has an enthalpy change of minus 635. The other way you can go from there to there is round all these yellow steps. So basically the sum of all of these steps, including this unknown lattice enthalpy, is equal to this minus 635. So all we need to do is put the numbers in and solve for x. So you should get a lattice enthalpy of minus 3454 kilojoules per mole. Finally, describe and explain the factors that affect the values of the lattice enthalpies. Well, the two factors are the ionic charge and the ionic radius. So we'll start with ionic charge. The greater the ionic charge, the stronger the attraction between the oppositely charged ions, obviously in that lattice. And then the more exothermic the lattice enthalpy will be. And for ionic radius, it's the smaller the ionic radius, the stronger the attraction between the oppositely charged ions, the more exothermic the lattice enthalpy.